The mics are blood clot open. Check, check, check. Select accent for the podcast. <laughs> Calvin, Calvin always late. It is the mics are open, episode 198, 197. 197. Uh, opposite, 19, opposite, opposite, episode 197. <laughs> Money is G Money. Andy Young. Ashley. Big C. Welcome back, sir. Thank you very much. Shit's gone. Bro, Are I'm not eating shitting? spaghetti from Sunday anymore. You? Yeah. Did you make it yourself? No. What's that place called? Don't mention no, your name. No, I can't, I can't do that. that. No, I, wasn't. I, can't I wanted do that, to see bro. whether you guys are brand compliant. What did yeah. you have? I, I'm, I, so I've had a very um, hectic two weeks, right? So mm. my whole trying to cook has really been messed up. So it's just been, I get home. Like two days last week, I had conflicts for dinner. Wow. wow. I wouldn't yeah. blame you. So many times I have breakfast for dinner. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Like, yeah. bro, I even mm. bust out the mm. sausages. That's and you know what? It. You know, he don't ever... the sausages. Oh, by the way, <laughs> bust out I the was sausages. Waiting. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I bust out the sausages. And you know, uh, guess, guess what I put them on? nice and thick. Oh, guess what I put them on? An air fryer. <laughs> air fryer. Come on. Oh, you know okay, where I'm busting us for the air fryer. You had me in the first half. I'm with Andy. But you know, yo, G, let me tell you, bro. Lazy man, how if you've got an air fryer you know us guys are the ones compliant fam foil up the air fryer uh-huh. i've been saying this yeah yeah yeah. that's legit I've been no 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 no. This. but now but now if you're lazy right yeah. and if you want to make like some nice beef stew bro i put the i put the beef inside you know chopped up i diced the onions i threw all of that i put the seasoning i poured the oil beef select and also that if you don't want to nice. wash your shit mm. but also the only problem was i just wanted i felt like it needed to be a bit stewy i couldn't mm. guess what you know that's that <laughs> it wasn't much enough <laughs> guess what because i was biting on that and Stop i'm just it. like <laughs> my ancestors are so sad dry fry with the stew <laughs> Thank you very much for advertising <laughs> air fryers. By the way, yeah, if again. you want to get an air fryers, come to the mics open. Why do you always trap? <laughs> huh? You always say flyer. Flyers. <laughs> come get an air fryer. We're giving away air fryers. No, Can't we just such a bully? <laughs> for real. But how, but how are you guys doing, man? How was it? <laughs> Oh man, I'm good. Let me start with you because these two are on one. Yeah, yeah, we can have a conversation. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm good. You? Wow. Yeah, all, is well? all is well on my end. Um, I'm excited. Uh, at least we had our first outside broadcast on radio this week. Oh yeah. So that 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 was a vibe. That was a vibe. Other than that, it was, it the first of was the year? It was good to Answer see the yeah. first in many months. Mm. Yes. <laughs> your mom was like, <laughs> <laughs> no, like yeah, no. tell me something I don't know. <laughs> but how has your week been, bro? Um, it's been your a, weekend? It's, it's been a, you know, it's been a very interesting week. Shout out out to, um, Saturday was extremely busy. Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh, shout out to the Sandwich Podcast, went to their live. Yes, yo, oh, no, that the was weekend. something. That yeah. was dope. Yeah. Good yeah. vibes, big up. Um, Tonio, Melly, and shout out going out to um, um, Eli as well from yeah. Man Talk. He was on stage there as well. Yeah. Um, of course, big up um, Owen and uh, Namita as well. Yeah. Uh, good vibes, good party, yeah, good everything. Good vibes, Left yeah. there, went to um, Nairobi Street Kitchen. Now, <coughs> I want you know sometimes you do a gig and you think that stuff. I don't know how this gig is gonna be. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let me tell you, NSK was litty. Yeah. yeah. On Saturday. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that. Mm. I know it's litty on um, on Thursdays with Sherman. Hey, Thursdays, it's Sherman, bro. Sherman thingy, um, Lordwin. Yeah, he's always like, "Yo, bro, that place is." Yo, Thursdays is a madness. Yeah, yeah. I just Never go there been. to look for a wife, man. But it was it was dope. It was dope. Um, on Saturday, and then it's a regular Sunday thing. Um, so it's been w- busy. When did I see you? Monday. Oh. <coughs> mm. But I've also got a discovery. Uh, but I'll tell you my discovery a little bit later. Uh, okay. How was your week? Ashley? My week's been okay. I've been recovering. Mm? From? Like after after the Shereha on Saturday, a girl got so sick. <laughs> Wow. So oh, yeah, we left you at the party, bro. At the after you party. You left at the other party. Yes. The other, other party. There was the other after parties. God <laughs> damn. Wow. Yeah, so we yeah, tapped my, out my early. tonsils just flared up and they've mm. been very intense. So yeah. I've been, in, I've literally been indoors today. Actually, since since thing. Sunday. Yeah. Wow. Like, this is the first time I'm leaving my house. Really? Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah, that's deep. Yeah, I was, wow. I, was, I, was, I was suffering. Wow. <laughs> but I'm good. I'm back-ish. Calvin? <laughs> Um, weekend, I actually didn't go nowhere. I was mm. literally, I was, I was doing some construction. So I went to Ronald and Gala. Okay. Where's that? Like downtown. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. I went to buy like a light. 
Okay. Yeah, so that was different, wow. bro. You're you sound so, so excited. excited. It's, it's, I know. It's like you, you, know, you went know, for an adventure you know, in the Amazon. The thing, the thing. So I was with my boy, right? And yeah. he's like, he goes to town quite a bit, right? And he told me, yo, let's go Ronald Ngala. He's like, let me go alone. I was like, bro, what do you mean? So we went Hail Selassie, boom, down. Like you're going towards Muthuru, then pop, we turn. Trekking. You know? Yeah? No, 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 we're driving, mm. right? Mm. Parked by Gill House. Mm. And then we walked down, right? Went to this building called R&D or something. Bro, town is different. I got so much respect. It I feel is. like us guys who live on this side, we're so far removed. Yo, this what is building, this wee business? Huh? Huh? This building, <laughs> this this wee business, bro. It's yeah. everybody on the, but other side, of on the south side of Waikiki. Yeah, basically, if you live on the south side, yeah, the that's this side. This, this side. If you live on the south side, I know. Is that side. But you know, like it's so, it's so good to see that because it actually makes you realize there's actually a lot of life in town. Because mm. everybody I associate with, and mo- majority, right? Right. Yeah. Always like, yo, let's meet here. Let's meet here. It's always right, around right. here. Yeah. So that one building mm. had like seven floors or something mm. and bro it's pure exhibitions there's one shop that oh. sells um phone car phone covers the other one's a salon the other one's selling speakers the other one's what 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 so it's it's just so one good to shop. see so basically babies they out babies they out more <laughs> or less then i finished that hit luthuli <laughs> boom luthuli went all the way down towards uh, Do you know there are people watching this right now saying why does he sound so excited about going into no, town? No, no, nah. like, listen, nobody can fucking take this from me. Because for <laughs> me, for me, it I was... Love it. You know what? I'm owning it because yeah. I felt like the entrepreneur in me was very excited. Because mm. I feel like we we glorified this side, and yet that's where all the money's at. Right, right, right. Get, like, I was just like, yeah, this is actually that, nice. That's where the hustlers that's are. That's where yeah. the money is. Mm. Like, you felt so good just to go into a place where, you know, we're not getting sold for cases at um, a thousand, three, a thousand and what. And that <laughs> same shit has just been, you know. Right, but it right, was right. really good to, to just see the, the, the actual people who drive the economy. Mm. Yeah, so it was really good. It was exciting. Mm. Yeah, that was the so uh, next election. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was, yeah you go do something over there. <laughs> that was the highlight of it, and then bumping into like people who are like, Mike's are open. It's Mark in the middle mm. of town. It's it's deep. That's yeah. love. I like That's that. Love. By the love way, it. shout out to everyone who's already got their early bird tickets for the Mike's are open the yes. live yep. on the 11th of March at the Nairobi Cinema. It's called yeah yes. Nairobi yes. Cinema. Mm-hmm. Um, what's really been cool about the live is that putting it together. And knowing like the level of expectation that people have of what we do, yeah, it's like all of us are saying, You don't know the sleepless nights that we're having, we're like, because <laughs> we have to do this, we have to do that. Yeah. Like, you know, for us guys, it's all about the production, so oh, yeah, yeah. yeah so we're looking lie. forward to create something amazing for you guys. I'm, I'm like, I'm so giddy on this, yeah, um, bro. I even the other day I was telling my mom, Do you want to see my outfit? You already, I already have, have an outfit. outfit. Oh my God, what are you doing, bro? Yeah, yeah, bro. I wasn't like, even thinking you? about yeah. an outfit. Oh my God. I am God. not even fucking playing, bro. When I was in Dubai, I was like, this shit is never coming out until we do a lie. Yeah. I need and to it's get no pressure or anything. I was Yo, just like, focus, Yo, focus, focus, yeah. fam, we've got to come out nice. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> When the when the fire when the fireworks are going off and shit, I went well. I just outfit change, outfit change, wow, outfit change. wow, no, wow. No. So so um so so yeah. This is the clothes are open. The clothes are open. <laughs> but you know it's funny because um I didn't really have an outfit, but now I have one. Like I got like I'm gonna wear like a suit. Oh damn! Yeah. But like yeah. a, a, a fly ass, like a fly suit. Now I need to put in some effort. Bro, like you have to. I know I'm looking for my outfit starting to. next bro, week. Like, anyway, like for, me, video, man. <laughs> for me, I am exactly. I am not letting no one take this excitement from me because I was just like, shit, we have an open, right? right. And I want to wear this. Like I was like, there's enough Fridays. Because yeah. now I have to wear like a bit more corporate, yeah. fucking corporate, right? Like there's enough Fridays where I'm just like, yo, let me wear this. And I'm like, no. So, people I, hey, share my brother. Can I, just, can I just announce something though, like uh-huh. about the live, right? So, you know, we have the open mic section on the, on the, um, uh, on, on the, the pod. podcast. I don't yeah. think that's a good idea. Wait, wait, wait. 10 people are going to get a chance to ask us questions. Who did you ask? But, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's not a <laughs> democracy. <laughs> wait, 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 can I finish? So you know what I've got? Uh, if you're selected for your, um, for you to ask a question, you get a very special pair of mics are open branded AirPods. 
Oh, that's dope. Oh, okay. okay, that's the fine. case is Damn. branded, Mike. So you'll be listening to us. When you open you your AirPod case, are open. The, you're listening to the mics are open with your own AirPods <laughs> with a branded case. Is, is it going to be one of them? Select accent for the podcast. <laughs> no, 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 no. So like, uh, can I, think, you know, I was thinking to myself, <laughs> you I, if, you wanna, if you want to get people involved, yeah, because yeah, I want yeah. the life to be jumping. Yeah. Then you go away. Every time you look at your AirPod case, yeah. you see the think mics are us. open. Exactly. Yeah. That's deep, man. Yeah. So, Wait, I have a question. Let me take you back to the outfits. Do we have a theme? Actually, no, no. <laughs> Do not ask well, these questions. Because now guys are going to start theme. thinking. No. <laughs> Come on, we can't beat you. No, you know, let me, you guys, I legit, I'll, I'll literally ask you, what are you guys wearing on the day of? And I need you guys to send me pictures. No, just, oh, I, if anything, do not even ask anyone what they're wearing. Just, just pick we something like, and yeah. wear. See, the babes get what I'm talking about. Because you have to know how, you know. No, you know, why? Ashley, Ashley, Wait, do you think it's your money consulted Calvin or no, the other way around? No, no, no. Ashley, like, let me tell you this. You can't fail the <clears throat> mandem who lock in every Friday. Of course yeah. I can. You, it's you me. know what I mean? Like, <laughs> just short fishnet <laughs> bro you went for the okay. jugular <laughs> niggas that day will just be taking mental photos you what? know <laughs> once we drop the po- once we drop the post okay of the live I already know what's on the comments I know what I'm coming but with but also do you, know, do you know what's interesting as well I'm um, really interesting as well it's that you know Nairobi cinema has upstairs and downstairs yeah mm-hmm. Downstairs is selling out fast, Big. and I always thought if I wanted, I'd want to be upstairs. Oh, you so used to VIP, view. Huh? yeah. No, it could be that. <laughs> I I wouldn't be upstairs, but like down the down because you you can select which where you want to sit, like mm. yeah. up yeah. or down. Mm. Yeah. But like the early bird up t- downstairs tickets are all sold off already. Yeah. Mm. So now it's just regular the regular wow. ones. So yeah. if you want to sit downstairs, I suggest you get your tickets quickly because downstairs. It's filling up real quick. It's the one, man. You know, Kenyans are last minute people, man. Everyone the, is waiting till the very no, last minute. No, but you know what? Bro. Our guys are not. Yeah. They're like, our they're, guys, they're, they're, they're our the guys ones. are buying tickets. So I'm just giving you, like, to help you along the way. Mm. If you want to sit downstairs in the center there, then you need to get your tickets, like, today, like, now. I walked into the office today, you know, right after the show. I walked in. I was like, yo, we're doing something dope. It's called the mics are open live. You lot all need to buy. Someone said, can I, can you thingy? Can you give me a free one? No. I was like, no. Nah. <laughs> I think you know words. Like I was, I was talking to the um, the show producer <laughs> earlier on today, because like there's a whole team. By the way, there's a there's a producer, there's the events manager, there's the uh, fabricators, and I was saying, you know what? By the way, for me, the way I look at this is, I because it's the first one. I don't even look at it like a money making mm. venture. Mm. I look at it like a statement of intent. I look at it like like as in it's like. We have an opportunity to, to create mm. something that when you look at it visually, you're like, what wow. the fuck are these guys on? Fact. You know? Mm-hmm. Fam, That's I'm talking like, up. if you imagine, you, bro, I, can you imagine today, me and Malik were out looking at floors. Mm. <laughs> Who looks at floors for a life? <laughs> you just work with the floor that you have. Yeah, floors man. is dope, And I'm just like, yo. You guys went to this this. We were in um, uh, the warehouse in um, out by Kikuyu. Kikuyu. Oh. Mm. Shout out to Basics. Oh, yeah. okay. Out oh. there. Basics, yeah. Okay. But we're going top of the barrel here, bro. Of course. All you know way. what's going to be so crazy? I think I might attend attend the service. You know, like they do church over there. Night before. Night before. No, the day after. Because we're doing it on Saturday. On yeah. Sunday, they have service. It would be good to see how they pray out of, uh, uh, the spirits out of that venue. Mm. <laughs> wow. Because it's yeah. going to be jumping. Yeah. Like the pastors are over there like... But they're just hearing... <laughs> what? And these, whoa, whoa, and these whoa. kickbacks. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> A whole lot of speaking <laughs> in tongues. Yeah, man. <laughs> but yeah, it's it going to be there, like your dad. But I'm excited about wow. it. My mom wants to come. Like, oh man. What? <laughs> what? Started, no, like, do not, do not no, even. No, no, that's no, I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. You, you, know, anything, bro. you know, like, okay, like, 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 sorry. <laughs> let me tell you. So he posted up um, <laughs> something on Twitter yesterday. Mm. And he was like, um, what did you say? I said, Calvin said he's going to ask his dad to buy a ticket. To <laughs> yeah, wild. yeah. Wild. And I was just like, you know, at times I look at G and this whole dad story. And I was just like, you know, like I was so at peace. I actually sent him a red card. Like he's so <laughs> lame. But there was no rebuttal. I was just like red card. Mm. Because fam, let me tell you, during the live, 
I've got my people, you know? Mm. Like, these niggas are the guys who shot down that balloon that was floating <laughs> over America. Wow. They're ready. <laughs> Those niggas are not playing. So you better come with your fucking tear ducts dry because wow. you're going to cry. I swear to you. This is, like, this is like WWE. Listen. Or oh, WWE. Smackdown. Smackdown. We're smacking you and your dad. Or oh, WID. <laughs> do, you know, do you know what's Where actually is that? crazy? <laughs> Do you know what's actually crazy? Uh, Someone said, G's dad is going to show up just to make sure he tells him, I don't want you in my life again. <sighs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. G's really thinking about his life. <laughs> Did you have we to take it there? Real there. Quick. Wow. I don't know what to say. But, yo, you I, I don't like 30 other responses, bro. Um, <laughs> take it, <laughs> boo. <laughs> Like, uh, comment, Whoa. share, <laughs> subscribe to the channel, man. Wow. Uh, you can't let yo. this nigga leave you speechless twice in a row. It's okay. No, it's fine. Happening. It's fine. It's okay. What kind of sick no, man will make after that? Lord. <laughs> I'm going through the notes and there's the nothing. Wow. Nothing can bring us back from anyway, this, bro. So, so, um, I'm going to... Where do we want to go from here? No, I'm, I'm, I'm easy. Yo. Wow. <laughs> so... Let me tell you. So I don't know. For the last week or so, uh, two two weeks, I've I've been going to physio because I I hurt my shoulder and my leg. I, I was I fell over. I thought it was about carrying your fatherhood. <laughs> so I felt I slipped. Proceed, G. I slipped when I was coming out of the pool. <laughs> Yo, hold up. This your story. Let's laugh first. <laughs> Who is we? You're doing it yourself. Bro, so we're, we're, we're just trying to salvage whatever is left of this podcast before the 11th. We haven't even bro. started. <laughs> That's the problem. So that we can give you intense. Before guys ask for a refund for those tickets. <laughs> no. I know. Like you on second what? thoughts. We're, we're nah, not going to come. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> no, you know what? I will not allow you to... I, you say what you want to say about that today. I'm not going to allow you to... To, to break my spirit today. Yes. No, I'm not. Yeah? I'm not. But you see that chi that you have? That was me yesterday. Were you at peace? <laughs> yeah, I was at peace. Was like you said. <laughs> rest, <laughs> rest in peace. Right, can I continue? Okay, you okay. So you cool, cool. I'm okay now. That's, that's a snippet of uh, what's uh, to come. Yeah, we have a, we have a boxing ring. A <laughs> uh, uh, boxing ring. Yo. So, anyway, so I slipped. Um... <clears throat> Um, two weeks ago, I came out of the pool in the apartment where I stay, and I slipped and I hit my shoulder. What? Yeah, bro. Damn, was it the weekend? It was no, it wasn't. Oh shit! Because I thought <laughs> you had some serious. shit to say. I need mean- <laughs> stop, stop. Oh god! Stop, just stop, stop. Right? So I hit my I, I, like you know you're breaking your fall. Yeah. So you like I kind of like strain some tendons in my in my shoulder. Mm. Um, we're talking about it last week actually. Um, yeah. yeah. So um, I began to physio, mm. and it's amazing how we don't think about there are so many things we take for granted like. Because we're all able-bodied, you know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, for example, like, so things that I've been able to do with my, my, um, like, I'm right-handed. Yeah. So even basic shit like carrying stuff and all that stuff has been so hard, you know? But you know what's been the hardest, bro? Mm. I don't want to be disgusted because it's like in the morning. <laughs> but wiping my ass, bro. Oh, for real? Oh, yeah, that, that can be a struggle. Because, like, yeah. I'm right-handed, right? So, you know... And you know, like we all shit, so let's not be surprised. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like so, it's like really and truly, like reaching back there. So, it's a I'm, so you know, me, I'm Mr. Regular. I wake up in the morning, get ready for work, fam, and I'm like, shit, I need to wipe my ass. I look to the right of me. What do I see? I see that bidet thing, that uh-huh. that spray that spray thing that Muslims use. Yes. To 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 clean up after they've used the toilet. I'm like, hmm. I wonder. And then I remember, like, in the office, there was a conversation once. Shout out to Daisy. Da- Daisy was like, I was like, I'd never use that. Daisy was like, I, you never use it because you're scared you're going to like it. I'm like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just, wow. Don't tell me she was right, she bro. Don't tell me she <laughs> was right, bro. I just never used it before. Yeah, yeah. So I looked at this thing. And I'm like, Why do you look a little bit too excited? Wait, wait, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Can I finish, yeah? Uh-huh. Bro, the conversation I was having with Austin before you guys came in, <laughs> let me not even go there. So, like, I looked at this thing and I'm like, I wonder. Yeah. So then I'm like, ah, oh, my hand's still hurting me. So then I lift up and take off the hook, adjust the um, 
<laughs> velocity. Velocity? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, now I'm like, how does this thing work? So I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> God damn. So I'm like, shit, shit. Not the scream. <laughs> so then I'm like, yo, bruh, but? why have the m- Muslims been hiding this shit from us? <laughs> This They've been keeping one, this information, yo, you mean? Bro, that You enjoyed it that much, you almost fell off the scene. bro. <laughs> no more skinnies. That shit is like wow. clean. Yo, you know, you know, crazy thing. Mm. I've got a Muslim neighbor who just moved upstairs. <clears throat> and the day she was moving in, I remember it was me, Zaro, and them. We're chilling, right? And she's like, I have to go buy one. All of us are just like, okay. Like, bro. Kumbe, that shit is addictive that, like this. It's not even addictive. <coughs> it's just, bro, it's clean, It's efficient. Bro, it's so efficient. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like, yeah, like, man. Like, what kind of pressure you put Because I read, well, I'm obviously not putting on rocket Between one and ten. <laughs> one and ten, maybe a little four. <laughs> no, like, like <laughs> you know. <laughs> but we, have, we tried all of them to know which one is, like, the like perfect No, only, only the ones hey, in there is also which one, one here? Which one makes <laughs> you tear? No. <laughs> what? Shut up. But the point I'm making is it's interesting culturally because I read an article Mm. during the World Cup and it's this British journalist and he said that why I don't know if there's an Arabic name for them or it's a guy say bidet. Mm. He goes, um um the Arab world's best kept secret. And he was like, Yo, I'm going back to England and I'm building this shit into my house. (laughs) Mm -hmm. The days of me and toilet paper are over. over. You get me? Yep. Bro, that shit's efficient, bro. Yeah, oh, that's something you need to try. Yeah, you have me everybody. thinking now. No, that's it's efficient, bro. Like, I like, mean it. You, you know, um, obviously, like in different countries, they have um, what do you call them? Them in hotels and everything. Yeah. yeah. You know, discovery, discovering things. So the other day, when I was in Dubai, I look at the roof of the the roof of the thingy. The hotel. Mm. Oh. Then there's like a sign at the top. Uh-huh. And me not being the too smart man I am, I'm like, why do they have a sign at the top? You know, clean mm. thingy, roof white. It had a sign to show the direction that Mecca is. Right, yeah. Like I was so fascinated by it. Like, but but even there's, there's even an app for it, right? There's Mecca yeah, Finder, right? Yeah. yeah. But I was just like, how accurate you guys have to build a structure but even and my, put all hotel rooms to. Even my pals who come to my house are so Muslim. Mm. Like they literally like they they ask me where which direction does the sunrise? Yeah. Like, sunrise is over there, and then like my my spare room is literally a prayer room for my Muslim pals when mm. they come, and they just go in there and they know so that that that's that's obviously the west. So I'm praying now to the north, I think it is. Yeah. Or whatever. So yeah. But I want to talk about prayers now that we're talking about prayers. Did you guys watch the news this week when we were praying for rain? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I saw that. I we never watched that. that. You know, you know this, 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 whatever, this uh, country of ours mm. needs a bit more finesse. What do you I mean? I feel like we're lacking employment for the correct people. What Why do, do we have people praying yet we can go back to our traditional homes and get some little rainmakers who've not had employment in a while? <laughs> Bruh. Do you know what? Think about it. Do you know what? No lie. When uh, we did an event in Uganda about 10 years ago with mm. Conscience, right? Mm. Do you know those guys pay the guys the, who do the concert? Yeah, pray, paid the rainmakers to say hold. to make sure that there's no rain on the day of the concert. For real? Yeah, like it's part of the thing when you're doing the gig, you pay the rainmakers to keep rain away. Yeah, yeah, man. So you see, I mean, we should use some of that. You know why? Why I'm saying that is this, right? We just saw Magoha, uh, the late Professor buried. Magoha, buried, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You saw Raila and all of them guys going into the homestead, dressed in all of that traditional mm-hmm. attire. What, yeah. what, what? We see all of you know different rites of passage and everything, all of these wedding ceremonies and everything. So when it comes to rain, that is where we're gonna draw the line. <laughs> it should be the same thing. I agree with you, bro. You're right, by the way. Yeah. You. yeah. Yeah, bro. Like we should do this, that. This yeah. Some of the hubs that you take, your mom will be like, "Hey, take this. Mm. It cures this." Yeah, yeah. So yeah. why not the rain? But you know what I've come to realize? Like a lot of the things that are traditional, people now look at them as shady, um, evil. Not even shady. Yeah, it's evil. Mm. It's juju. It's whatever. And yeah. I'm just like, it's not juju. Malevolent. Yeah. Even asking like your um, 
wakubwa what are they called the elders the elders, elders. to pray for you a lot mm. of people think that's like juju it's not juju these people used to pray like this from a long time ago mm. yeah. Yeah. so it's literally just carrying on tradition so yeah. it's i think it's that negative um connotation it has to it that people don't even want to the western yeah, world has really just <laughs> but here's the, here's the question here's the question. colonization <clears throat> like honestly like let's how do we really feel about the the national day of prayer for for rain and famine I didn't even know about it. Yeah. I, I think first and foremost, the stadium didn't look that. Do you know packed. what's crazy? Uh, that's my first point. Yeah. Journalists were writing uh, um, a packed Nile Stadium. It, it really wasn't packed. Was they were just on the ground, on the grass, on the dais, and yeah. all of that yeah. thing. Yeah. No offense, to I just think they have they they'll pick whatever reason to have prayers at this point. Like but they you, literally had prayers every single weekend at the. <laughs> At the state I feel like mm. Go ahead, go ahead. No, I, I feel like it's very performative. Yeah. And um, I, I had, I think in the news this morning on radio, uh, something along the lines of the government wanting to place the church at a certain, the you know. The yeah. center of um, yeah. governance. Yeah. And, yeah. I, and I'm like, we... My nigga. The, the, the religion the religion card we, we don't want to play it where they want to play it or place it where they want to place mm. it we don't need all these theatrics mm. so that you show us that you have the religious mm. uh, side on lock no these guys mm. didn't need whatever you're giving I, them to I, do whatever they're doing right now i honestly think that the reason for that central focus on religion is because religion is the opiate of the masses yeah so true. if people if you want people to be really sheep if yeah. you want to create sheep, religion, religion. religion. Yeah. yeah, that's it's the simple. one thing they can't argue but, with. But they can't, they, so it's like you look at it this way, right? It's like this. It's like <coughs> religion ties in all these things. Churches don't pay taxes, right? Mm -hmm. So the church doesn't pay taxes. Mm. And think about this, yeah. Me, who pays over twenty-five percent taxes every month, must now take a further ten percent mm. and give to the church. Yep. To give to the church. To do what? Balling! To, to, to buy, to, for the pastor to, to, to buy a house. To buy, to buy wine for the, mm. for the sacrament. To build sacraments. bigger mm -hmm. churches. Mm -hmm. to build and live in bread. To go now, for expeditions and in a, in, a, in a time like this, when there is famine globally, like, no, not globally, like right across the arid areas of the country, right? Yeah. Fam, how come they don't see the churches opening their coffers? Yeah, like really? saying that we are—we uh, made a nice ten billion last year. Yeah, 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 yeah. in this one branch of our church, you know, it's, we're donating one billion of the ten that we have actually yeah. to the you, famine drive. You make a very valid point because I see the Safari Com CEO. He's a chair of it, right? Uh -huh. And he's always on the news saying, "Oh, actually, last week he was in the news saying that the situation's pretty dire and it's actually going to go all the way up until maybe around uh, September or something, mm. right?" And the guy, he was there as the CEO and the leader of it, right? The, the steering <coughs> committee for hunger. Number two with him was the chairman of the media association. There was no national council of churches of Kenya. Mm. Right. You get? Mm. And those guys collect a lot of money. So yeah. I can, so a lot. So I want to ask another question. Mm. In these arid areas mm. where there are churches, I assume, mm -hmm. are those churches there still collecting offering? For sure. Yeah. That, so you have to put a man on the ground. Like at the end of the day, like you know, I'm I'm not averse or anti-religion. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not whatever your religious perspective is, but I think that we live in a society where we <clears throat> should question. Mm -hmm. And the question is, the church has been silent on so many, many things, things True. that impact us, bro. During COVID, fam, church was mighty quiet. They were broke. Because cause they were hit. <laughs> they were hit That's right where it hurts. Like they were hit in the pocket. The COVID, COVID showed everybody, you really didn't need this church, this thing mm. that you call the church. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever it is that you are getting from church, you can get it at but, home but, but or in the I house. But, but it hit them in the pocket, bro. There's a difference between watching church on your screen in the mm. living room, uh -huh. having not changed... You know, yeah, you put and, and then they put the the lip on the screen. And nobody's doing me in my house. 
farm. You can't see me. Stay well. Bro, bro, that even the pastor, <laughs> even this pastor can do the but service. On, but on, it's just like, in boxes. Yeah, from the house. <laughs> but he doesn't fall. But it's like the guys on this channel. Remember how guys tell us, you guys are dope. We need to have a... We need to have a... Put the number. Put the till number up. Bro, I don't think a month has gone by when we've received more than 800 more. Bro, <laughs> this nigga's be like... Oh, no. This, this guy's been smoking up watching the podcast. Uh, I tell you what, party and go over job. <laughs> Hey, I'm going to give you a point. 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 i am going to give you a the podcast so mm. you you guys best buy the tickets yeah, 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 yeah. Kindly, <laughs> kindly buy the tickets Please. but you know you know back on that whole um tip of of, of um thingy the, the prayer thingy mm. let me shoot holes in it even further right so when the government came into uh thingy and i'm just stating what's there for people to go out and clarify right mm. the government has really had a very a drive towards um uh reforestation right mm. planting of trees saying oh we're gonna plant <coughs> trees in counties i even saw um what's the cabinet sec secretary for trade he came up with the whole initiative with cs Co courier uh, courier right there was a whole thing about trees and everything so we're working with people who understand the fact that uh trees and the mouse summit and what have As something to do with rain and all of that right yeah. when, when they've articulated all of that so when on this other front you come and say oh lord we're trying to pray i'm not sure uh, shit on anyone's religion mm. but god gave us brains right mm. we've exercised those brains and known that science is this is our, a result of yeah. right the president yeah. attended uh you know <laughs> cop what is it the COP twenty two or twenty three, yeah, whatever. Yeah. yeah, he's a man who <coughs> actually spoke about UN and his daughter and his daughter as well, yeah. right? But also you saw him at uh, at the United Nations and he spoke about agriculture and mm. everything and what and what. So, so the science is known. The science is known, right? So mm. if we're actually gonna have uh, a day like that, you know what? I feel like religion and science can coexist, mm. right? You get like have a day where you actually say, okay, guys. This this is what's up. This is mm. things, the merits, the merits. But also at the damn at the same time, we've not said don't pray. Yeah. Prayer. Yeah. Yeah. Prayer is important. No one is you stopping get, you. Yeah. yeah, no one's stopping you. But yeah. please don't make the rain situation mm. out of God saying a bro. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you're making it a spectacle. Because it has been, yeah. I mean, it, it the weatherman already told us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's, a long time ago he already told but, us. But, but but you know what? I'll be honest with you guys. I love it like this. Huh? The weather, like the heat, yeah. Me too. I I, I love this weather you know, more than the cold, cold weather. Cold body, like I like the cold. You like, know, you know, now you're just cold well. for the first time, uh, mm. ever, mm. like in years of doing breakfast radio. Bro, I'm leaving the house every morning without a jacket. Mm. Mm. That shit. Take is, advantage like, of it. You know, bro, it's yeah. unlearning literally. Mm. I'm mm. just like, what if? Mm. Yeah, kinda, you don't trust the weather. What yeah. if? Yeah. 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 But, but I'm I, just like, but for me, I'm stepping out without take, no jacket. <laughs> I take the weather every morning before I leave the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah every morning religiously because because I, I need it on the radio anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. To me, yeah. So I'm always like, you know, 17 bro. degrees max temperature today. Like today, today said 30. Yeah, and 30 are what? Yes, it said, it said 30 at 3 p.m. I was like, yeah. what? Yeah, I like the yeah. weather, man. Gee, I yeah, love man. it. Like, I'm I love it. And I, I think it's interesting because when it gets to the cold, then you see the next people, oh, it's too cold. You changed. You're changed. in shorts. Oh, well, yeah, I, was, I went in shorts to work. Oh, were you? No, oh, I changed. I went, to the, I went to the gym. Ah, okay. So oh, I went wow. You guys can wear shorts to work. Damn. I've been wearing no. shorts. Like, you can? All of us put out, like, for yeah. the last yeah. week. No, I, it's not that I can't. It's just, <sighs> you don't have the legs for it. <laughs> I mean, you know, G's a bastard when it comes to his legs. You know, how's your legs? My no legs thing. are fine, man. You know, actually, sculpted. <laughs> you, know, you know, crazy, crazy though. Um, like last year, was it the year before? And I was gymming quite a bit. I remember one of my uncles telling me, "Yo, your knees can really give in if you start <coughs> when you're getting older. You shouldn't run on the treadmill too much." Mm -hmm. True. Um, I was doing a lot of walking on Saturday, and I could feel my right knee. I was like. Damn. Mm. Even like skipping rope and stuff like that, mm. you shouldn't do it. But be careful. Like, you, 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 your, your knee might give even up. Even your uncles, you. yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> no don't oh finish that God. sentence, bro. <laughs> 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 even your uncles. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Even your uncles. Yeah. Me, I'm, I'm, I said, your, your knees <laughs> might give up on you. Be <laughs> careful, <laughs> man. Because, I mean, it's something you can relate to. So, so. <laughs> <laughs> we need to stop this. Let's declare a truth. What? <laughs> like, no, uh, until uh, life, after the do life. Do you trust Calvin for a truth? <laughs> until the life, no more that so joke. So we save it. We save it until the life. No more that joke till the life. <laughs> we got to get security. Why? <laughs> for the life. In case you can't feel it. Because you know me, I've got a whole bunch of like, yo, bro, I'm not even You've playing. stuck them up, yeah, eh? man. Bro, I've taken up a but co-working how, space. How, how do you feel? Them. How does it feel to have so many people there for you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, like you know what oh I love god. about it? In mm. in a very fucked up way, we could actually send sell this to an ad agency as a dad campaign. Yeah. You get, like in a very fucked up way. Bad, like, bad, bad dad, dad, dad jokes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like 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 it could even be like me and G dissing each other all day. And then a professor comes out and says, You see, the trauma of having your father not there, mm. it affects them even at Bigger big age. age. So that's you wanna eat a check for that one? <laughs> no, bro. Yo, a condom. Listen, uh, it's a check for that. that to make I, money, I, I, I want I want that one. Oh, you want that? Eh? Which one? Like, yeah. Damn. Which dad? Oh sorry. <laughs> oh wow, Andy. <laughs> Not you too. Wow. Andy joined the chat. <laughs> but Not you know, you just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. You know, but you know the craziest thing, imagine that campaign, like in mm. it going on to win like lorries and shit. Yeah. And then your dad shows up. Like he feels like wow. damn. This is because of me. This is no, no, no. The guy's like so whipped. He's like shit. Yes. Or oh, you could have it like like your dad's watching your journey through life, uh, but he's not there. I think huh? it'd be perfect like, for that. Like an empty chair, like In an empty screen. chair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So he's damn. watching. He's watching like you go through. Are you not serious? Yeah, this is what? I love how they're coming up with a brain. Yeah, it's literally a brain from session. Yeah, yeah. Like Father's just, Day, just an empty chair. Bro, we should shoot a Father's, Father's, Father's Day campaign. Father's Day campaign. None of you motherfuckers. Yo, let's patent it. We're going, we're right going to patent it. Cut the, it right I know where the office is. No, you <laughs> motherfuckers in ad agencies. Don't you dare you try to come. That really? Father's Day campaign is going to be sick. deep. Like it'll be, yeah. Deep. Don't say anymore. We don't need anybody to. Yo, yeah. man. Anyway, you the, that's how you, you got the guys here. On Reddit, man. Man, I felt jealous, man. How they said, I, well, I'm just kidding, right? They said that. Oh, Andy, yeah. Andy someone, like someone, let me read that. Who? Damn. Oh, yeah, we did, and, yeah, we did the like, math like, kind. Like, I think know, I was a honestly, Valentine's baby, when bro. I get home, my you mom, probably were. My yeah. mom's at home and everything. Yeah, right? shout so out my parents, home, man. I'm going to ask her about it. I'll be like, so did you guys plan for me? I don't think most people are planned for, though. I was such an oops, baby. Oops. I was, the, I I was the oopsest of the. Your son wasn't planned. That you pl- I mean, I don't think black you were people. planned. Oh, you're planned. Yes. Explains your calm nature. Wait, wait, wait! Stop, 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 stop! Your <laughs> mom and dad planned to have you. Why are you so surprised? I'm surprised. <laughs> I don't think black people what can plan <laughs> like that. So what was the, what was the thought? I'll, I'll repeat what you said. What was the thought between being planned? Uh, we're, we're two boys and two girls. So two boys and two girls. Okay. First born was a boy. Uh huh. We're twins. And then See, you were the last born now. I so said they wanted another boy after. Uh, then oh, then they wow. wrap it up. Wow. Or not? <laughs> or not. <laughs> Bam, that's actually interesting. So are you? So you're the last born. So I guess your parents are probably like maybe in their sixties. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Okay. Wow. People plan babies my, out my, here. I mean, my daughter was planned for. Shut up. Jojo, we love you, Jojo. <laughs> what you say? Sorry, sorry, you, sorry. When you get to watch this, <laughs> all for bands, all for I, bands. I take that back. Oh, no, 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 baby. I take that back. <laughs> you haven't watched this. <laughs> you all for bands. Plan for baby. Where are you? Back. Was she? Yeah, she turned stand this weekend, actually. Oh, well, yeah. okay. Wow, oh, your PR team. Yeah, yeah, your PR yeah, team yeah. is oh, outstanding, dope. Calvin. I have to give that to you, Manze. Your PR team, amazing. Yeah. She turned stand, man. Your bro, they just sent the list of things that we're doing. Uh, When's her birthday? On on the 19th, okay. So she wants to do, I can't mention the venue and everything, but yeah, Mm. on this Sunday. Mm. Yeah, big bash kind of thing. The other mom was like, can we go to church in the morning with her? I'm like, "Uh, okay, I'm going to show up. 
Right. Yeah. Okay. It's ten. You only turn ten once. Yeah. No, that's yeah. a big thing. That's but a apparently, big age. she's not concentrating at school all of this week. It's everything. Birthday, 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 birthday. <laughs> birthday, birthday. <laughs> yeah, like, she's, she's, turning a, 10. she's actually just thinking about her birthday. Mm. Bro. Like, what's up with girls in this thing? Huh? She's turning ten. So Ten's the next big, big thing is what? Sixteen. Oh. Nah. Nah. Not 18. sixteen. Probably thirteen. Nah. Oh wait, when he hit the teenage. Yeah, probably but 13. Actually, the onset no. the on, like the onset of now puberty puberty. No, I hated that a, shit. As a girl, mm. it's not cute. Your teenage How was it for you? you get your periods. Like I didn't like it. My fifth, my 16th is now where I, ha- I kind of had freedom to like go hang out with my friends, you know, do mm. certain things. Mm. I'm getting allowance now more often than my 18th is where I'm just like <laughs> Gee, fuck yeah, shit I know up. you have something to say. <laughs> You you wanna you wanna respond to that one? You wanna no, take no, that no, one? Yeah, no, I'm, no, I was just thinking. Why like, are you, you know, looking at me uh, like that? Like you having your freedom at sixteen is beautiful. You had not your freedom, freedom at nine like or at five. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's beautiful, man. Like, uh, no, not freedom like that. Just like basically being allowed to go and meet your friends in the mall. What the fuck are you holding the your mall? tongue back for? Movies, huh? yeah. Movies. What are you holding your yeah. tongue back for? I feel what? like I'm listening to a movie. Why? You know, you know, I've watched these guys long enough to know what kind of comment were you about to make. About like, how you rolled your tongue and everything. What, what? were you going to say? When she's 16? No! No, I'm saying it's beautiful. To, the way she was describing her freedom at 16. I thought it's beautiful. It was beautiful. <sighs> Fucking liar. Moving on. Look at you, Grace. <laughs> no, like, <laughs> like, okay, she said 16 was the next monumental stage for what about you? Because I think I we know, all agreeing I'm on different. 10. I, 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 if the, you guys know me by now. I don't like birthdays. Your birthday's, birthday's coming tomorrow. up. Yeah, yeah. Live, yeah. Live, live alone birthdays. Yeah. Like that stage or that age that was monumental for you. Like Ashley, clearly her 16th, as well. right. her 16th. Her 16th was I like... My, I had my first birthday party when I was 16. Uh, as a high school and it was a surprise party. Um, <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. I, I don't think you're getting me. I'm not talking about birthdays. Ages. Yeah, like for example... <laughs> 13 for the onset of puberty or something. Yeah, it was funny, bro. <laughs> this guy is dying. I bet it's nothing, man. It's finished. <laughs> I don't like Calvin, you know. Yeah, let him I take his ball. Guy. <laughs> say with yeah. your chest, nigga. Say Just say it. <laughs> Not the pointing. Get your hand down. <laughs> You're a fucking 16th surprise birthday party. <laughs> <laughs> Just say it was by that day. No, he wasn't. <laughs> Imagine if he showed up in a very <laughs> surprise. <laughs> like your birthday even wouldn't be the surprise though. You're crying because of that. Wow. Like, wow. I think in a very fucked yeah. up way, man. Yeah, you know, yeah, um, like <laughs> monumental age. I think for me, um, I think. Oh shit. Probably the age. Actually, probably right? the age of, no. of of thirteen, maybe twelve, thirteen. What one? I, I, I think because you know that's the age I remember the most because I, I was moving country mm. but in terms of like I've never really been like this was such an amazing experience I mean even when the first day I jerked off it was by accident <laughs> so <I was> like, <laughs> no by accident <laughs> it was friction oops <laughs> Nigga, nah. It was. Hold up. I'm did glad you, we asked this question. Did you bust that and realize, oh shit, that was jerking off. Accident. Is that what happened? I don't want to get into details. No. 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 Wait, wait, like, wait, wait. Calvin, it's too late, wait. man. It's too no. late. Gee, did you, once you bust it out, is that when you Can were I just like, oh shit. Like, what? Bro, what do you mean accident? Talk <laughs> us through it, bro. <laughs> no. No, talk us through Damn. it. It's not Listen. a democracy. No. Talk us through it, bro. Did you hear Barack Obama say, you know, the first time I... Why are you thinking about Barack jacking no. off in the first place, bro? <laughs> no, that's fucked up, bro. That's messed up, bro. There's guys out here who be sending G messages like, you're my mentor. I, so Mentors now jack be, off. Yeah. I can't give you no stories like that. You never know. Yo, you can go on the podcast. That's why he gets it. the big bucks, bro. No. Like, no. Why, would <laughs> we wanna, why would we want to fucking That's why he gets the big bucks. Because they can't tell us about their first jacking no, off experience, bro. Actually, honestly, I think there's some things we can talk about. Do you look do you look at you as your father because no, that, that's the only point I'd be no, disturbed no, 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 like that, bro. No, no, no. Like, 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 wow. Like, yo, we're going to lose some street cred out here, bro. What? Like, imagine guys coming to say hi to you at the club and you're DJ. Bro, your one kid story was the one. Yeah. God damn. We can now see you, man. Yeah. Honestly, you were on the pod last week. You watched the pod last week. Clearly what did you guys talk about? The start of it. 
the very first thing we spoke about in the pod. Mm. What is it? We're saying that my hand wasn't working, so I have to use my other hand if I'm jerking off. Yeah. Like, Calvin, it's too late, bro. bro. Yeah. Yeah. Pause, but we're in too deep, man. You want it? Yeah. You want so, yeah, it? you were telling us. Yes. <laughs> Andy's not letting this one go. It's not like it. yeah, Come boy. on. Oops. Come Oops. on. That wasn't an oopsie, Move bro. Move it on. Oops. Bro, I, I don't think guys are going to let that one go, bro. Guys are not going to let that well, one well, go. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, you know what? Here's the thing. I'm willing to tell you the story because it's a quite funny story. But if we sell out half of the life <laughs> here comes the cash. by next week I'll tell you the story ben, no just say I go. too far just say guys can find it come watch it at the live what? no what? no what? no oh, shit. no no no, no. that's not what you are going to do Calvin no. that is exactly no. what you are not going to do you are not there. going to have a jacking G-G off booth wanting to unblinded by your grace ah oh, stop, oh, stop. not blinded by Even your grace Yo, no. you're messed oh, up wow. in the head, bro. No. You have an no. anthem to go with it. No, that and it's blinded by your grace. I'm blinded Stormzy. by your grace. <laughs> wow. Nigga. You need Stop help, bro. Stop. Stop. What no, else you, do you, we have to talk you, about? You, you need yeah, help, let's bro. Let's talk about Riri, man. Rihanna. Like I, saw, I saw someone say... The father stretched my hand. The father stretched my hand. Oh, that's the one. That's the one. That's the one. Father oh, stretch my hand. You guys, are, you guys are, are stupid. That's a tweet. Father stretch my hand has got to be the best... Wonk song ever. <laughs> no tweeting. Byron. Yo, father, yeah, come Another come. banger. I love it. <laughs> That's so, the title right there. Father, uh, stretch my hands. Jesus Rihanna. So, yo, yo, yo. I saw someone say that ASAP needs a job. Yeah. ASAP, um, like ASAP. ASAP needs a job. ASAP no, Calvin. I think, he's, I think he's doing his job. No. Calvin, I think you've exhausted them for the rest of the podcast. Oh, yeah. shit. You before, didn't we talk, before we talk about ASAP, mm. I promise this. All right. So today, uh, Malik and I went to. Like, look at this stuff for um, the, the, pod, live show. the live show, right? Yeah. As soon as we, walk, we get to the place, this guy's name's Brian. I told him I'd say this story on the pod. He says, hey, what's up, G-Money? Wow. I thought you would have come early. I'm like, Pause. why? Pause. <laughs> I'm like, why? He goes, because you're G-Money in the morning, not afternoon. <laughs> I was like, Brian, <laughs> it's so bad, it's so good. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow! 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 You might need that. He was like, he was probably like, I was he like, was so excited. He had been saving that joke, life. bro. He been By saving the it. <laughs> bro, this is what I'm saying. Afternoon. Yo, it's so bad. It's so club. good. I love I it, bro. Him, I said to him, "Okay, Calvin." <laughs> And then he just started laughing. <laughs> He's like, yo, you have to admit though, it's the only joke I've got, but it's funny. <laughs> I'm like, okay, He's Brian. So cute. Shout out to Brian from Basics. Oh, <laughs> Lord. Tell that, tell that story. Where we go? We go back now. Oh, wow. Yo, really, Where? though. Uh, really? Really? <laughs> A lot of mixed opinion on her performance. Also, I love how when she started performing, everybody was like, "Is she pregnant? Is she pregnant? Is she? Pre- is it postpartum?" But she's really? pregnant. Yo, yeah. If I just know if my Nyeri people were watching that, <laughs> did she really, really do it? <laughs> <laughs> but I like the somebody fact stop this nigga. Please. I like the f- <laughs> shut up. I like the fact <laughs> that Rihanna actually gets pregnant. What do oh, you what? mean? Compared God to damn. Beyonce and Kim Yo. Kardashian. Beyonce what has gotten saying? pregnant twice. What is this point? You know what? Yeah. <laughs> this guy, man, Atikoni gets pregnant. The fuck, man? Fuck, come on. She's that got him. So Yo, bad. she's got him. Kim Kardashian's got him come pregnant. Come on, man. guys. Do you really think <laughs> that Beyonce and Kim Kardashian had those second and third children? I don't know. But I, I know for Kim, it but, was but like but her fourth kid yeah, yeah, yeah. that was a surrogate. Exactly. Yeah. But and the other Beyonce, one, she came, but for us was also because of medical con- yeah. condition. Yeah. She came out, yes, and said it. She just can't. Beyonce too. Beyonce? <sighs> anyway, Beyonce I'm, got her twist. So what you're didn't trying she? to say? The agenda must agenda. <laughs> Yo, what, what are you trying to say? That, 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 that Jay Z, that Beyonce didn't have no reason. Rihanna doubt. fucks to get pregnant. Huh? Yo, there's so much going Jesus. on on this set right now. <laughs> Jay Z did have the blue. Everybody <laughs> has a joke to deliver, and they're trying to deliver the same. T- <laughs> Beyonce was <laughs> crazy, crazy in love. Jesus, where did it stop? <laughs> <laughs> and then we saw blue, she's like, then, she, girl. then she got oh, pregnant. Man. She got oh, pregnant. Oh. Then Jay Z was like, I'm the Magna Carta. Oh, Jesus Christ. What? My head is going to pain after this one. Before, after he was big pimping. <laughs> 
stop. But then you know she she had to come out and say this is not Lucifer. This is not Lucifer. You've that's a Jay Z song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. <sighs> We should love, no, we should no, love it ended. We should love it ended seconds can we stop? ago. Wrap it up. We should love it ended seconds up right ago, now. Bro. Wait, wait. So where were we going before this? <laughs> Rihanna's, <laughs> pro- yeah. Rihanna's Rihanna, performance. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. so, so, so let's, let's, go back. let's go back. Let's go back to this whole conversation, right? Planning <laughs> and planned pregnancy. Was Rihanna, does Asa Brocky and Rihanna look like they can plan a pregnancy? Yes. Yes. Mm. I feel like. ASAP just there's shot the a, club up. There's, a, there's an interview ASAP <laughs> did a couple of years back where he said, like, he's addicted to sex. Like, anywhere. He, yeah. if, he's, if he's ready to bust a nut, he'll bust yeah, a nut anywhere like, and like, everywhere. Riri, Riri came out <laughs> and know. said when she found out she was pregnant. <laughs> she was shocked, ASAP, yeah. ASAP and Rihanna are going to be together forever. It's true, because they That's have the same energy. Couple. Same Bayesian background, so they're both, they're both um, Barbadian background. Mm. End of the day, like, have you noticed, even, when's the last time he chucked a song? The he's, other day. he's daddy duty. Yeah, he's, he's a he's husband. Like, listen, he's huh? happy, bro. Like, How's has, husband? Think about it, right? Mm. Like, ASAP Rocky, I mean, he wasn't even that good a rapper. <laughs> oh, <laughs> right? come ASAP, on. No, no, right, no, right. No, ASAP Rocky, no, no. some dope bars, right? What's his, the, the biggest song I know from him is, is, is that song with... Um, Praise the Lord. The spray, oh, that was a big tune, though. Yeah. Mm. But also, he was on oh, that fucking Problems Kino. with Two Chains. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. He's, got, he's got, I mean, he's not a Kendrick. Kendrick. Mm. He's not a Kendrick, but he's got bars. Yeah, but he's here. got a few. He's yeah. got a few songs, right? Yeah. But, like, he's found, obviously, he's found happiness. But, like, but you see where, where he's up. He is. found love in a crazy place. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> he's sorry. Wow. He, got, he got sheltered. Huh? By Rihanna. Uh, well, she put on the umbrella. Oh, well, he doesn't uh, use the umbrella apparently. Oh <laughs> but, yeah. but you know what's crazy? Like ASAP, I don't think he's really struggling when it comes to music. Fam, imagine ASAP, bro. Yo, you're Rihanna's baby daddy. Everyone wants a collab with you. Yeah, but I'm saying he doesn't even need to do music no more. Do you not know, think about it, right? I think sometimes, like even like a couple of days ago, it was Valentine's Day. Mm. I think like. He's just probably in love, fam. Like, he is. He's, he's like, sprung. yo, I found my space. I'm sprung. I'm good. He's legit sprung. Yeah, I think I he's thinking. But I feel like, bro, also... did, did you see it, but how he was like, bro? Yeah. You, there's, there's a way in which you, you know when a girl gives you the phone and says, take some bitches. There's there's this cool, yeah, safe. My but also was he. Like, and yeah. he was jamming at the but, same but, time. But that's that support shit. What the fuck are you? No, he also to put do? in some it's serious work that, in the friend zone. It's, yeah. it's either that. It's either that's that. True. In the friend zone. What do you mean? ASAP has been there since the Uno, bro. People would never you, noticed. Would you yeah. Even, yeah. The friend zone, yeah, yeah, though. They, really they've friendly, always yeah. been together even since day one. Badass, badass I was very through her relationships that. and through the dramas, through everything. Really? ASAP's been there. Mm. Yeah. ASAP, when, when she was the right, boys, boys. that billionaire. But oh, yeah, yeah, that Arab, the Arab guy. guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So you see, so that's why I think it will last, bro. Yeah, and yeah, I, you're right. Yeah, and I'm with you. And they're also Fam. at par. Like you they know, have yeah. more creative you know directors. Are they the next or not? They can't to, be. I'm, I'm gonna knock on wood. And but bro, me, I really don't know, bro. Like these things, eh? Mm. At times. You know they're not even married. They're just boyfriend, girlfriend, yeah, partnership. But I someone fuck said, up. someone said Rihanna has two babies with a man that hasn't put a ring on her. <laughs> we're the same girl. Ooh. Yo, like, like that, that. That has done everything for feminism. What? Yeah, but I'm saying, I, but we're it's just Gucci. I genuinely believe that, like Rihanna and ASAP Rocky, mm. the, the the energy feels good between really good. them. Really yeah. good. I think it appears to be good between them, and I think given the the common background heritage, yeah, you know, it's like. How you like you said? I didn't even know there were boys like that from before them. Yeah. So this is someone they probably hung out before, and it's mm. like my man's always been there. Like man, if I got a chance, man, like I'd smash. So now he got a chance, he smashed it. Or yeah. maybe he knew when he smashed, he'd fall in love. Yeah. But you know, here's and the he'd thing. be there forever you know, that's, and that's, ever. That's the policy out here on the road, man. Some of these bad broads, bro. Mm. Come on, slow them down. If you if you have a thing, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Did you that? Just pull a nini. You Oops. said put a baby no, in them you know, and you know, let you them know, sit you know, down. Hey, 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 enough, hey, enough, hey, enough. Hey, enough. Like <laughs> you know, you know, you know the way like, like the, the cops throw that bubble way across the road. Yeah. <laughs> Gotcha. She's like, she's like on, she's on 120 in her range. Then, 
you know what I like? I love that occasionally we oh, just- Oh, you got to get new tires. I love, that, I love that occasionally we just have a stupid pod. Today is that day. <laughs> Yo, before, before you even move from this conversation, allow me to clutch at a straw. Uh, and it's a moment of vulnerability. Mm-hmm. I know y'all might not back me up on this, but it's fine. Um, I'll lead, okay, I'll start with uh, a scenario, right? Uh, uh, I think it was today. There's someone I follow on. <laughs> it's so funny also. It leads to a, a conversation we also need to have. Mm. Why, why did so many people launch their significant others on Valentine's Day? Because for the longest time, I didn't know so many people were dating until Valentine's Day, right? Really? <laughs> honestly, yeah, yeah, honestly. But then I was I was on IG and uh, someone I've been following for a while. I saw they posted up with their bae, right? Okay. I usually like their photos, but I was like, I'm not liking that one. Right. But then I was like, yo, what did I just do? Because <laughs> I've been following this person for a while. Yeah. I like their photos. <laughs> But right. now because the boyfriend is there, you now I'm not going to like this. And it's something I've had so many babes talk about even on TikTok. Like when a babe who is maybe married even with children is posting up a TikTok just by herself, she's going to get so many likes. Right. So many likes. But when the husband is there, when they're being maybe lovey-dovey, like everyone is just a like few fuck likes. Fuck you and your shit, man. Yeah. Why? Why do we do that, uh, bro? Come on, man. It's just, it's just being uh, real, man. You gotta be no. real. Yo, I went back and I liked that photo. I was like, I have no reason not to like this photo. But they look cute say, together. The, the person who whose <laughs> IG page is, is mm. she is she fine? Yeah, she's fine. I mean, like, how do you feel about? Is she your friend? No, no, no. We're not friends. Oh, but like it's a, that maybe yeah. that that online maybe. Okay, vibe. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Like I, I follow you. So you follow me. You, we like each other's content. Do you, do you, and you didn't know that she was dating before. Yeah, yeah. friends, right? Yeah. So maybe. And we've never just, talked. We've never had maybe a conversation. It's a disappointment. Like you're like, oh me? shit. Disappointed yeah, like, that she's okay. Maybe, it's maybe mm. I don't know, but maybe it's like, like, like shit. Boyfriend. Boyfriend. Mm. Fuck you. Mm. Maybe it's that, that that whole thing, like yes, it's just it's just false advertising, false advertising. Mm. Yeah, man, you you feel me? Like, okay. bro, you've been out here just seeing this car. You know what I mean? Like, why you? Why you? Wiggle? Yeah, why are you wiggling in your bro. seat, bro? Like, like, you've been you know, this, if, if this, you're on this, audio, you need this, to come visual, bro. Porsche, it's bro. just like you know, you, like you rave it, it's just sweet, bro, bro. Bro. like the back shakes, bro. bro. Then, <laughs> then one day you just see this old nigger inside it. You're like, God damn. So wait, am I the only one who's done this? Huh? I guess we've all done that. No, it's not a matter of I guess. I used to be that going the podcast. Y'all never allowed it, so I won't allow it this no, time I'm, round. I'm, I'm trying to think about it's it. It's like, either you've done it or you I haven't like done pictures, it. And then, but I don't. I don't like old pictures of anyone anyway. So okay, yeah. Ashley, uh, like maybe you're looking at Mandem on. You know, usually I like their photos, cute. and then now suddenly he shows up with Shodi. Nah, fuck that shorty. <laughs> <laughs> so you won't like that photo, right? No, I like it, but I'll be spiteful. <laughs> I mean, unless I've been looking at the why, mandem why? fun. If why I've been will looking you be at the mandem sideways mm. and I'm just like, ooh, you look like you, you know, you can get mm. some. Mm. And I never knew, like, though the in a relationship, he was mm. in a relationship. Mm. Then if I find an image of the girl, Bro. I just be like, mm. Let me tell you something, though. <laughs> not like, so attractive anymore. Not so attractive anymore. <laughs> let, let me tell you. Why don't uh, I have to follow you me, anymore? I love it. Wow, you're going to unfollow, <laughs> unfollow Ashley. That yeah. <laughs> for me, bro, for me, uh, for I love me, it. I, I ain't got no problem, bro. Like, mm. if you know, like, we're calm, right? Because mm. here's the thing one thing I've come to discover out and about a lot of people out here on, are on higher patches. You get? Wow. Guys are paying installments every single wow. month. Wow. And at some point, eh, the repo man comes. Or, collect. or they make the final payment. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Two ways. So it's two ways. So <laughs> up until you make the final payment, the big glass belong to you. Guys are on higher purchase out here. I and just don't need no temptations and, on my and, TL. <laughs> okay, and that higher purchase, right? Have you ever seen this this like cars that are getting repossessed? Mm. They're hella cheap out here. Yeah, crazy. Anyway. Crazy. I am I, um, I actually saw there's something that happened on Instagram this week. Mm. A, a pal of mine. I, like I'm not, we're not with you today. <laughs> Um, and like he's a man, road man. Obviously, we've known him for over 20 years. Man deleted every picture on his IG. Is there a button for that? Left it black, and you, know, you have to do it individually. No, you have to do it individually. That's a lot of he's work. An album. You know what he did? Mm. Mm. Then he posted one picture, and uh, the picture he posted, let me show you. I can't show you, but I'll just so Andy can see what I'm talking about. Then he posted up a picture like that where he's sitting there mm-hmm. looking calm, mm-hmm. and it's like five different pictures. And then he posted up 
Out of nowhere. Oh, not a wedding photo. <laughs> out of nowhere, bro. Like, look, I like, love it. Oh, back to back wedding pictures. I love he it. Everything of his eyes. Wow, 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 oh, wow. He's wow. very handsome. I'm inspired. Wow. Ashley, Ashley, I'm sorry. Sorry. yeah. He's, he's also very <laughs> married. <laughs> and then There's a big rock. Eight, yeah. like these eight were, pictures back to back. Nobody knew. Wow, was, wow, wow, wow. Yo, wow, I was wow, wow. sitting with some girls of mine. I'm inspired. On, I was like, that is cold. I'm inspired. And <laughs> that a lot is cold. of. A lot of niggas do this so i was mm. sitting with my with my girls on um last week friday i think and randomly we're sitting there and the, one of them goes like oh my god so the other one goes like what's happening shows him a picture shows her a picture and she goes like wasn't he at my birthday yes he was he didn't see say he was getting married this man was throwing his russia that day yeah. has wow. a full no, baby as well nobody knew of it's not called a ruasher it's called a small meeting <laughs> small meeting small, small. Small. Up, bro. And then, no, the best thing is they were doing the the, the ratio the baby had got the baby was born about uh two three weeks before the actual ratio uh-huh. nobody knew about the wedding the ratio the baby nobody knew jack shit no one asked so they're all so shook and they're just like this guy was at my birthday the other day no one asked i, I no do you know do you know there's something babes no one asked. there's no this there's something babes don't understand guys don't just volunteer information and actually you and uh nimrat have talked about this on the double-sided tape True. there's things that men don't find necessary to share that women are like you should have told me this it, it didn't come like up i'm getting married Yes. Yeah, no one asked. <laughs> what of what concern is this to you? Yes. Do, you well, do you want to marry me? No. Exactly. So why why are you surprised? But uh, Exactly. Would you tell me if you're getting married. Actually, I have a different relationship with you. Valid. Right? They have a relationship as well. I'll But also, to be told. what exactly you assume that um I'm supposed to let you know exactly what is happening But in my life such that when I'm going to get married, I have to let you know. Let me tell you fam. Don't make that this assumption ha- actually. This happens all the time. I know someone. Don't right? make that assumption. I know a chick here who like the only way that we knew she was married was on her WhatsApp stories. <laughs> That's one day bam, it just on the WhatsApp. And you know the thing about it is? The thing about it is when somebody puts stuff on their WhatsApp stories, they just what you know it's for family. Speci- yeah. yeah. It's this is for family and oh, oh yes. You need to see this as well. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yo, that's that mass thing, bro. Yeah, man. So I think people are entitled to oh, you owe me this information if it's that. No. Yeah. No, but actually, if you got married yesterday and I didn't know and you came and told me today, I'd be like, "Yo, congratulations, man. How was the wedding?" I want to go like, "Why didn't you but, tell me?" But, but let me ask you, but let me tell you something though, like I'd get mad if no, any of no, you no, didn't no, tell no, me. No, 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 no. I I slightly disagree. <laughs> okay. And this is a true to life story. There's a time mm. um And it's someone we do business with at the moment actually one of the very first friends i made in kenya when we mm. came um, through <clears throat> and i remember uh, you know habida the singer yeah mm-hmm. she was getting married mm-hmm. and my gift to her because i knew the husband as well was i was gonna pay for the sound at the wedding right so i called my guy and said like, yo i need i need this for the church this for the reception i mean this is my pal who supplied this come mm. next the week after that he was married he got, he got oh, yeah. married i'm like But bro, you never said that. Like you, like, you never say you were gonna get you gonna get married. Like yeah. there was no invite. There was, it was yeah. just like bam. And mm. this, I'm like, yo, like that. To me, I felt that like was weird. Mm. Yeah. Now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, are you done? Because I'm saying like. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I just don't want to interrupt no, no, before you land. That, and the yeah. reason I say it was yeah. weird is because mm. I hired equipment f- from, from you, you mm. for mm. a wedding. wedding. Yeah. So nothing sparked in your mind because then I'm, then I'm gonna say to myself, I'm I'm really gonna think. I mean, okay, maybe you don't rate me mm. as yeah. a friend. Like, yes. I didn't really, and I, mm. that's how I felt. Yeah, but, but okay. the relationship was the quite transactional. <clears throat> Allow no, 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 me. we're pals. To this day, it's, I'm not meant to yeah, name yeah, but yeah. Yeah. the guy who supplies us stuff yeah, for yeah, stuff for you. stuff. Yeah. So, um, but, and it, it dented yeah. our friendship not for the a while. Man. Huh? Not the weak man. <laughs> not that one not that plug no, you know when man. you say supply stuff I have to no really. no, 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 no that's a different <laughs> story <laughs> you know, this guys were now like oh, oh, but, oh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> but mm. it affected our friendship for a while I felt some type so of now, way so now allow me to play devil's advocate and this is why I can afford to say such a thing because if someone went through with that you have to look at it from their point of view uh-huh. you know despite the relationship that you have and how close you are why did this person not tell me that it doesn't have to only be one option and that's the only option that you think but, because what if mm. together with the wife they agreed you know what i think it's 
the, it's in our best yeah, interest. That G doesn't go, that we know, don't no, G. no, not just you. Like, like Maybe I'm, it's not just you who didn't know. But yeah. even me, I wouldn't want G money at my wedding. Like now, that's a different you know, story. Yeah, at that now, time, at that time, you were signing autographs, right? Like, True. Yeah, like why? Why? Yeah, why would you want to steal the attention off of my date? That's wow. a real man right there. <laughs> Securities. Oh, wow. Anyway, anyway, all, all I'm trying to say is you have to look at it from their perspective. This is two people who came together and made a decision that yeah, you know what? Then, yeah. Or maybe because now what what like what, what is happening is of course you're going to be selfish because bro, I wanted to share this moment with you, but this is his moment. It's no, not it's our his, moment. It's actually her moment. His or her, her moment. moment right? Yeah. His and her moment. I get it. Yeah. But, but my point was mm. like. As y'all know, I don't have a wide range of friends. Yeah. yeah. So it's like this, and this was like years near, just like ten years ago. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, right, like I couldn't imagine sitting down and getting married and not inviting this particular person. Yeah. So it really makes you assess w- the position that yeah. you have in their life, in their as life, opposed yeah. to the position that you. Because the thing about it is, it's like not invite. If 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 Ash got married and she didn't tell me and she's getting married. I would feel some type of way. I'm See? not going to lie. I'm yeah. going to feel a way. And it's not even that. Like, I feel even if you don't want that many people in your wedding, whatever, if you've mm. decided you're going to have 10 people mm. or 10 of your closest people, mm. the need to know. Just even if it's just telling me mm. and informing me, communicating and telling me I'm not able to invite that many people. I wish I could invite you or I'm not going to invite you yeah. because of X, Y, Z. But I would have loved you to be there. You can come for the reception. You get what I mean? I, I, hear, I hear you yeah. guys. And all I'm saying <clears throat> is, yes, Honestly, yes, I'd love to share that moment with you, Ashley. Like, being for real, for real, yes, I'd love to. But if in the event, you know, that whatever happened in your life, uh, things led to me not finding out or me not being told about your wedding and finding out way after, I'd be like, you know what? It's okay. For whatever reason, you know best, Ashley, because of the relationship that that we have. So now you're carrying a now, burden that you don't need to, to, to. I mean, let's be let's be honest. Like honestly, in, in, in actuality, I'm I'm setting you free. I'd be hurt that you're not hurt. So you don't want the freedom? I don't want it. Cage me. Man, you know what? <laughs> me ain't feeling some type. Don't of tempt way, me. <laughs> you know weddings are. So you know, if, you if, know Ash, if Ash got married uh, and she didn't tell you, you wouldn't feel the type of way. Bro, she will pattern at the bar. <laughs> wow! You get here's the thing: weddings, four K okay. plates. We'll, we'll be in each other's weddings. We will come and pour about it. Weddings, four K plates. So let me ask a question: I've saved like, like, because you talk about weddings, like, you don't think that, like, if you had a wedding, mm. and you didn't invite us, mm. we wouldn't feel the type of way. Calvin, I won't. Let me speak for myself. <laughs> me, I won't. If I didn't invite you lot. Mm. No, he says he, he doesn't would, care. Would, what about you? Well, hey, 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 I, 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 I didn't say I don't you care. You basically no. did. No, no you're, you're, no, you're rewarding what I've said. I've said, Calvin, I wouldn't feel some type of way if that happened. You know, you know yeah, honestly, caring. it would be a good publicity stunt. <laughs> what? For the wedding? <laughs> Ask Why do you not need a up? publicity stunt for your <laughs> wedding? Oh, yeah, some no, people no. need some. <laughs> Oh, no, no, but I mean, I know, but un- Don't un- understand. Don't remove your hand from me. <laughs> no, Honestly, anyway, anyway, listen, guys, I have to invite you motherfuckers. Come on, you guys need content so that even <laughs> <laughs> me, I need content. <laughs> oh, that wasn't supposed to come up. <laughs> no, it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> this is the mic. Yo, this is the mic. Wait, wait, we're done. Yo, yes. yo we're done. Yes. <laughs> ah, guys, come on, we just started boarding. <laughs> <laughs> Say your name, huh? yo. My Calvin, we are not finishing this podcast. <laughs> Me and you are not finishing this podcast. <laughs> you know when you, you, know you say some things that you actually say. I didn't think about it. It wasn't. That wasn't yeah. the answer. Sit in that moment, bro. Oh, Save yeah. it. My name is Andy Young. Ashley. <laughs> hey. Oh, oh man, the stupidest Jeez. podcast.